Well, as coronavirus cases decrease and more vaccines roll out, when will employers begin to relax their safety rules? Jeff Newmeyer is live uh, in Fort Wayne for us tonight with more on a big issue in that workplace. Jeff. Yeah, Brian, we're here in front of uh, Kelly Chevrolet on Lima Road. They sell some uh, 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 Chevy and GMC pickup trucks that are made at the Fort Wayne uh, GM truck assembly plant. We want to make it clear that that uh, General Motors plant in Southern Allen County and all others in North America are not cutting back on workplace safety restrictions, not at all, but those restrictions do create some mixed feelings for hourly UAW employees who are made at times to feel a little uncomfortably, uncomfortable, I should say, because of having to put safety first on the job. Now, in March 2020, when the uh, threat posed by the pandemic became uh, so very real, General Motors, like many other large employers, shut down manufacturing plants, such as the truck assembly plant in Fort Wayne, idling workers for several weeks. Last summer, union employees came back to work but had to have their temperature taken uh, before starting their shift, and they wear their masks as they perform uh, a variety of physical tasks, even though those masks are hot and make everybody's protective goggles fog up. We have pictures of GM workers masked up at the automakers Kokomo and Fort Wayne operations. UAW members know the safety measures are designed for their protection, but that doesn't mean that they have to always like them. Many of those workers hope they will soon see the finish line on this. 2020 didn't come with a game plan for COVID-19, so we didn't have any idea what we were going. We were learning as we went along. We just wanted to keep our members safe. I'm glad that it's about over. I feel like we're on the road to victory, so that's a good thing. If that uh, precludes people from wearing masks, I'm thinking a lot of them will take the precautionary members and get the shots. But again, you know, our people are still working on top of each other, and, and we're getting, we've got a couple hundred cases certified now, and we get three or four a day. Now, Letourneau says the new cases pop up all while plant production's running full tilt. He sees some hypocrisy in how society in general is dealing with big COVID-19 issues like workplace safety. A statement from the management of the Fort Wayne plant says since June 2020, the company has provided best practices in safety protocols for workers and customers. Goes on to say this protocol has been successfully used every day, including at Fort Wayne Assembly, adding the safety protocol will remain in place until the CDC and other medical experts suggest these actions are no longer required. So, Brian, mask up. It's still the battle cry for America's workplace. Indeed, Jeff. Thank you.